Wake up. It's time to kickstart your day with Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration. Daily Dose of Inspiration. Good morning and welcome to this brand new day. This is Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration for Friday, March 16th, 2018. And as you wake up and you start this brand new day, Thank God for this day. Commit this day to Him. Use this day to bring glory and honor to our Lord. And use this day to share your faith with someone and encourage somebody. And while you're at it today, give God praise. Because He is worthy of our praise. He is worthy of our worship. He is worthy of our thanksgiving. (coughs) Excuse me. Our scripture reading today is taken from the book of Ephesians, chapter number 5, and it's verses 1 and 2. Scripture says, Be ye therefore followers of God as dear children, and walk in love, as Christ also hath loved us, and hath given himself for us an offering and a sacrifice to God for a sweet-smelling Savior. Friends, we need to follow God. I'm going to put it just plain and simple. We need to follow God. Follow his instructions. Follow his leading. Follow his prompting. Follow his, his leadership. You know, a lot of times we know about God, or we understand about his principles, whatever, but when it comes to actually following and doing those things, we fail to do that, and and I'm pointing the finger at myself before anybody else. Paul says, be ye therefore followers of God, and as a result of being a follower of God, verse 2 says, and walk in love. If we follow God and we follow what he's told us to do, and we follow his commandments, we follow his leading, then walking in love is going to come naturally because God is love. He says, and walk in love as Christ also hath loved us and hath given himself for us an offering and a sacrifice to God for a sweet-smelling Savior. Jesus showed his love for us by being a sacrifice for our sins, an offering for our sins and a sacrifice for our sins. Paul's alluding back to the Old Testament sacrificial system where people would bring in an animal to be sacrificed and its blood would cover their sin. That's what Jesus was for us. He was the offering. He was the sacrifice for our sins because of his great love for us. And as a result, we need to do the same thing for others. Not that we need to go and we need to be a sacrifice for someone else, but we need to go and we need to maybe sacrifice the things we want to help somebody else out. So as we go into the weekend, are you going to follow God today? Are you going to follow His principles that you see in the Word of God? Are you going to walk in love, helping other people? And are you going to walk in love the same way that Jesus loved us? Think about that as you go through this day. And remember, get into God's Word. And allow God's word to get into you and then share that word with someone today. Have a blessed day. Thanks for listening. Check out our website, www.myscripturelinks.com.